tatlong winners ang pipiliin ko. Tag 500 pesos each. I'm not really a burger person. I don't really eat that much burger. So if I like it, it means it's really good. Because as I told you, I'm not really keen on eating burgers. We'll take you along with us and we'll let you know if it's worth it. So we'll find out. We'll see you there. Mayong aga. Sunday nya yon guys. Weekend off, walang paso. Mabalikan namin yung um, burger place in Napa. We went there last week, but the line was too long, so we didn't bother uh, lining up. We went home. We just drove around Napa, and after a week, we're back. So. I think it won't matter if the line's gonna be long. We're still gonna line up and eat because it's our first time trying this place out for a nice burger. It's a local restaurant. It's called Guts Burger. How do you spell Guts? G O T T S. Guts Burger. Well, you got to get a new personality because nobody wants to watch you. <laughs> Walang nanonood sa vlog namin Kasi I have no personality Oh well I do these vlogs to Document my life So then 20 years from now 30 years from now 50 years from now I can always look back And check out What was going on in my life you're alive. I wanna. <laughs> <laughs> it's your life too. It ain't my life. I got an exciting life. Continue on red top road for one I'm mile. I'm documenting our life together. Very, very exciting. So when I grow old with wrinkles in my wheelchair, you already are. You're so mean. I'm not mean. I'm about reality. You're a mean mother. This place where we're going to is in Napa. It's a county next to ours. It's just probably 10 miles where we're at. So it's close by. Dadaan na natin ngayon yung vineyards dito sa Napa. As you can see, those are all vineyards. You got that convertible. I mean, I put a sunroof up. I gotta have some sun. This one is what? X5M Sports? This is an X5 Sports Baggage. It has a straight six turbo. Try it. We are here. Okay. Everybody having fun. We're still in line. We've been here for what? 25 minutes. 12 30. Yeah. Takes forever. It's gonna be all worth it though. Uh, uh, can I get a, a double uh, bacon cheeseburger? 
Uh, what do you want? Uh, just corn in a cup without butter. The Mexican street corn without butter? Corn without butter? Uh huh. Uh, can I get onion rings also? Onion rings? Oh, bacon cheeseburger. Yeah. Uh, two Longanitas IPAs and a glass of water. And can I get, get a pineapple shake also? Um, the special. Yeah. Uh, yes. How's your beer, babe? You better have a burger. Can't beat a, a good beer. Long and IPA. We got the guys right here. It's a nice weather out here. What's the, what's the temperature? Got a little cool breeze out here. And, uh, Napa, California. Got my beer. It's 73 degrees. Partly cloudy. Zero percent participation. The UV index is very high. I should have put my um, sunscreen lotion, but I don't need it. I got the natural tan. Got that little wind. This is my last beer for today because I gotta go back to work tomorrow. I only make it a policy to drink on my days off. I only drink on the days that end in Y. And what day is that? Every day ends in Y. <laughs> drink in moderation. Good times, my friends. Good times. There ain't no good times because we're in the middle of a recession. Uncle Donnie said we're going to have a tax break. Is that for sure? I don't know. Look at that tax. I didn't get anything from that stimulus package because I've been still working. Is there a second stimulus check? They, they haven't decided yet. All right, right here. Thank you. Thank you. Is there ketchup inside or? Uh, I can grab some. Okay, thank you. Thanks. You got a straw for your milkshake? Yeah. There's the burger. Is that recording? Yeah. That's a cheeseburger. You can smell that deliciousness. Onion rings. Oh. I got my pineapple shake. I can take a picture of this my beer. And here's my corn. This is what I came here for. This is the star of the show. Look at that. Meanies. Oh yeah, you can see that. Look. Got the tomatoes. The patty. The guy has some bacon in here. Onions. The cheese. Oh my god. Back to that. Delicious. Oh my god. It's the meat itself. How would you rate it? I'll give it eight out of ten. It's good. That is a good burger. I'll give him that. Hmm. Pretty good stuff. Look at that. This one. Is it worth it? Oh yeah. Look at that. I'll come back again when it slows down. Let me eat some of this right here. Mm. Did you order taco as well? Nope. I told you to. Mm. Try some of this onion ring. Yeah, special sauce here. I don't know what Try out that first. Let's see. You put butter though. That's cheese. Hmm. This sauce is pretty delicious too. Like a garlic aioli. Mm, no, no onion rings are good. Beer battered. So, I give the burger about it. I get an eight out of ten. 
pretty good. But the onion rings are really, the beer batter are very delicious. And this aioli sauce, which is here, is really delicious. Right here. Mm. Is it worth forty-five dollars? Yeah, I could have saved fourteen dollars for them, like thirty-five, thirty bucks. But I got two beers because you gotta be happy. You gotta drink every day, and then why? And then today's Sunday. <laughs> <laughs> Seriously, it's nice to get out of here once in a while. Been locked down since March 17th. I'm used to working at home, but this idea of being locked down all the time, it's very depressing. So this is kind of a sense of normalcy, even though you gotta wait in line. But yeah, it's worth it. They're taking safety precautions. You can see no wiping out of tables, it's disinfecting. Get the lines in there. It's very clean, hygienic. So, anyway, so, we'll get past this. Second weekend that this place opened. The second weekend since they allowed dine in in California, here, at least in Napa. We started opening up some places. I know LA is still pretty much locked down. I got a friend that works down there. They say into August or maybe July, but people got to work. They got to get the economy going. If they don't, it's going to be in probably the worst situation we are. But. Anyways, I'm lucky to be a to have a job still, so can't complain. Work from home. It's all good. Anyways, back to my food. How do you like that burger? It's good. Is it, is it worth it? Yep. It's delicious. I don't really eat burger, but this one. Hmm. That's I fresh. I like it. That is fresh. I think I'm just hungry. <laughs> That's why. But it's really good. That is a fresh burger. I think I'm gonna get me some oysters after this. I've been craving oysters. And we're right next to uh, the oyster place. The hog island oyster. Let me drink a little beer. I'm gonna finish up a little bit. Even though it's a little windy. But that is, look at that. This is like a delicious burger. It was worth an hour wait. How's the corn? No, it's okay. Is it worth four fifty? Gotta have ketchup. I don't know. I actually, the, the person at the table she, she got me ketchup for me, which is really nice. Yeah, I have really good customer service skills here, which I appreciate. Let's see this ketchup. I think it's. Ketchup is really homemade, but it's fresh. This is a homemade ketchup. It doesn't taste like Heinz. But I think overall, nice way to spend a Sunday. I like the milkshake as well. Pineapple milkshake. It's all worth it. It's four fifty, but it's really good, guys. The corn is four fifty. The milkshake was like six bucks. Six, six, six. Oh yeah. It doesn't give me the prices, but it's okay. Mm -hmm. Kinda enjoy life every once in a while. Can't go around with beer. Then all you need is IPA. It's delicious. Oh God. One down, one to go. Guy always gotta have a backup. That's my motto. Even the IT person, I always believe in backups. That is my model in life. <laughs> I always have a backup. But these onion rings are delicious. This, this ketchup is good. I'm gonna take some of this ketchup home. I got an extra container there. It's like very fresh. You need a bite. It's a homemade. It's a homemade right here. Huh? Fresh onion rings. That ketchup is delicious too. It's, I think it's really, it's, it's not like, um. It's very fresh. I don't think it's Heinz, but it's like... It tastes like 
um, Filipino ketchup. It's sweet. Nah. And a little bit of honey. Okay. Mm -hmm. Well, I can't complain. This is Northern California. Almost July. And the weather is 73 degrees. Where can you get that at? You can't get that anywhere. Coming from Vegas right now, I used to live there. It was like over, right now it's probably over 110, 105. But they, it's, what they say is true. The humidity is what kills you. And Vegas is very low humidity. You feel that heat. But here you got a nice breeze. But um, you pay for that nice breeze with California taxes. You may make a little bit more money out here, but I think it balances out. I, I miss Vegas. No state taxes. Even Texas. But Are we going back to Vegas when we retire? I'm going back to Vegas because I like to gamble. <laughs> So the reason why you're going back to Vegas is of gambling. That's right. And, and the cost of living is cheaper. And I'm gonna go back. Oh, I'll probably end up doing this um with my job. I'll probably end up retiring in Texas because uh, no state tax. They balance that out. When you retire to what state, you don't pay the taxes. If I retired out here, I will still pay taxes on my retirement, which I don't want to do. So probably in the last five years, I'll probably retire in Houston. No state tax. I'm gonna take a, a hit in my check. No big deal. And I'll retire in Houston. But that's a, that's a, that's a long time away, though. I, I, I may change my mind. Because I'm not that old. I'm only like in my 20s. Yeah, right. Because I'm very, very. No, he's not. Yes, I am. He's old. Because I said it. Look he's, at that. He's not in his 20s. I'm in my 20s. Believe me, guys. Hmm. Look at that delicious. Look at that. That is that is a grind up burger. Hmm. Put it back in the box. I eat my onion rings into my AO sauce. We got that fresh ketchup there. I'm gonna bring that one home. I'm gonna bring both of them home actually. This AO sauce is pretty decent. It pairs well with garlic. That's pretty good. Yeah. So fresh and crunchy. One more onion ring. It's a big ring right here. The battery's almost dead, my friend. <laughs> Where you want to stick that in? <laughs> Sicko, I'm telling you. <laughs> I'll stick it in your ass. That's very good. That's very disturbing. <laughs> I, I can't be around people like that. You know, today's Sunday. That means it's time to reflect. What does Sunday mean to most people? It means going to church and being thankful for what you have. But it's Sunday. I don't know. <laughs> Days are ending wide. <laughs> I gotta finish this burger because I can't let this go to waste. This is so delicious. But you see that grease? Oh my goodness. This has gotta be like a. This is the last meal I'm gonna have for like three days. That's, I'm gonna be broke paying $45. <laughs> <laughs> So it means you can eat for two days, right? Two days, I eat. I bought my whole bunch of food. All the beef's gone. Got cheese. Very Gucci sounds. The burger was really awesome. Highly, highly recommended. I passed my test. This is my celebration for me for passing my test. That's right. <laughs> Dennis, we talk about the blogger all the time and she makes fun of her. That's why I like going to that Dennis. She's <laughs> very funny. So babe, overall, how would you rate this place? 
Oops. Get an 8 out of 10. 8 out of 10. It's a good one. Good burger. Good service. It's very, uh, you can't cuss a lot. I mean, everything cooked fresh. And I really concentrate on the, the disinfecting cleanliness because of uh, the current situation we're in. Guys, meron pala akong iaanan sa inyo. Um, since pumasa ako, meron na akong certification. So, happy ako. Imbis na mag-antay tayo ng 350 subs, matagal pa yun siguro, guys. Kasi, wala namang nagsasub sa akin. Parang awan nyo na mag-sub na kayo. <laughs> so, sabi ko, pag antayin ko na mag-350 subs, baka aabutin tayo ng 10 years. <laughs> Ganun ba? So, imbis na mag-wait tayo ng 10 years bago mag-350 subs, sabi ko, magpapag-giveaway na lang ako ulit. Kaya naman, pipili ako sa ating mga subscribers. Tatlong subscribers ang mananalo ng tag 500 each, 500 pesos. Uh, Mag-comment lang kayo guys sa comment section down below kung saang state kami dito sa Amerika. And paki-comment na rin kung magkano yung tip na binigay ng asawa ko nung binigyan ko siya ng haircut. Thank you all for watching. We'll see you on our next vlog. Bye! I'll be available.